so here you can see this is one of the you know one of our challenging areas with all the hills and the, uh, this is why we've got the hill pro you know, uh, they brought this out to me like three years ago or yeah three years ago as a demo uh, and uh, Kevin and them was in here and we put it in a field where we was running 18 percent grade and uh, they asked me, what do you thought? I thought, I don't think this planter's leaving my farm. <laughs> it's done so good. The accuracy, the efficiency of it has made a big difference in our seed operations. When we go from planting 40 sacks to the acre down to 28 sacks to the acre, or you're planting with uh, 96, 98 percent accuracy uh, and we get on hill slopes and angles that are, are from 18 to 5 degrees and we're continuing with the same, same accuracies. We'll go anywhere from on from an eight to a nine inch spacing, we'll be running about 3.8 miles an hour. We get down to the six six inch spacings, which is about the tightest, tightest we do. And we're putting down 40 sacks to the acre, uh, and we'll be down to about 2.2.5 2 is you know right in there, and we can hold them accuracies of that. Where some of our old planters, we'd be down to a mile and a half an hour. We'll go from planting one drops to planting three ounce cut yellows, you know, so uh, there's a big difference and there's no adjusting on the planter. The planter takes care of itself. Uh, we just set what spacing we want and away we go. As it comes down through here, really focus in on, on the cups and uh, the hopper. The hopper moves with the cups, but watch the cups, they, they stay vertical all the time, no matter what what uh, percentage it's onto, up to like 12, 13% grade. So as you can see right there, it's laid back quite a bit as uh, the planter comes through. But if you notice, the cups are still set completely vertical. And uh, as it, comes out to the flat you see that everything straightened out my cups are still vertical uh, usually on a downhill specter we're usually overloading the cups and and getting doubles with this planter we're keeping them single a great accuracy and as you watch you can see the gap difference you can see it start leaning forward as he's climbing so nothing's falling out of the cups and uh, we're getting that 96 98 percent accuracy on climbing the big steep hills too The hills are a challenge, but you know I, I keep forgetting about the hills because I've got the hill pro. You know and they're they're not a challenge to me anymore. As far as you know our fertilization and everything we used to be really worried about, it, but the hill pros took all of the guesswork out of it for us. Uh, we know we can get it right on the hills, in the valleys, in the swells. Uh, so the hill pros, it's kind of like. Uh, I, I used to think, oh man, you don't want to farm on the hills, and now it's like, well, they're, they're not even an issue to us anymore. I recommend the, the Hill Pro Planner to uh, just about anybody that has any types of hills, swells, valleys. I'm Smokey Gould with TNS Farms. I'm running a Spudnik 8560 Hill Pro best planner on the market.